This thing here is a pipe bender. It's not a tubing bender. A pipe is always very thick walled. So this is a pipe bender that I got from the internet and it, I got a really good deal on it. This whole thing with all these different size dies for different size pipe, even really big pipe, was only $45, $45. But shipping was $50. So it cost me $95 to get this. And uh, we're going to use this to put some nice uh, rounded bends in the go-kart. Because um, otherwise we'd have like sharp corners like this. And I think it's a little safer to have a cart with, with rounded corners. So that's what we're going to do. Are you ready? Yep. Got to turn that clockwise. Now that, there you go, righty tighty there. And now you want to start uh, pumping on the handle. A while, and usually, and I find it's often easier to do this make two bends rather than one sharp bend make start it and then back it off and do a another bend otherwise I think you might get a crease in the pipe. Okay, let's back it up and we'll spread out the bend a little bit. Okay, tighten it up again. that nice and tight, yeah. Okay, now what I like to do is get my square up here and see if I can measure it. Mm. We got a ways to go, don't we? Okay. A little bit more. That's, a, that's actually past 90 degrees. I'm going to do it a little bit more because my feeling is that often the pipe springs back after you release the pressure. Let's see if that's true. Oh, that one actually didn't spring back. Cool. What we're going to want to do is bend that back just a little bit from where it was. So you can see we have a nice smooth edge on the outsides of our go-kart in case someone gets banged into they just it's or if you hit a tree you don't gouge into the tree but you bump off i think of, of this is something of a safety feature three cola oh no this is my bent pipe okay i mean here's how it's gonna go <laughs> No, I think it's going to go like that, and uh, we'll put, uh, bring that up over to the thing with the floppy, with the wangly wheels and the nice lady, oh. Good job. I, a, I never even, I was this a Cleveland. I'm just going to bend this back a little bit so we get a nice 90 degree. I'm going to try heating it with a propane torch. This is a little bit slower than heating it with the acetylene torch. I do have an acetylene torch, but this was a lot easier to get out and uh, it may be sufficient. But if I feel like it's really slow, what I might actually do is get out the acetylene torch. Acetylene first. This is much, much hotter. And when we're using that, that pipe bending machine, we'll get a little better at using it so we know exactly how far to bend to get a 90 degree, or very nearly a 90 degree. That's awfully good. <laughs> 